Hi guys, my name is KNG the King himself. I'm your superstar host and I'm welcoming you on behalf of DGG. Yes, I'm welcoming you to DGG. What is DGG? DGG is Daily G's Galore, showing on Olubori TV every day. <laughs> um, uh, I'm just happy to welcome you here. Please be just joining us. Like this video, share with your friends and families. Click on the notification bell and also drop your comments. Yeah, this is another update on the BB9 just season seven. Yes, or modify the you know, you know, so yesterday someone said that I believe it to be very, very good. Yeah, if big brother can just leave the house for them, so you be like, you know, big brother go leave the house for them last, last. <laughs> season seven is level up. I'll keep on reminding you guys, season 5 was locked down. We only called the match as the winner. Season 6, season 6 itself, was Shania Heights where we have white money mm, as the winner. Then, you know, we had likes of Grey B and little, all lot of them. Then. then this is season 7 and this is level up. And it'd be like seeing a Elo Swag go. Because as they go like this, Elo Swag, the, <laughs> the para who, you know, Elo Swag, wait, for this season, I'm just saying, Elo Swag has won the head of us two times. And even for the for the third time, he has been chosen as a deputy. Well, now, it's drama upon the drama. You will be evicted if we are both placed for possible eviction. Shakes, brags, and messy fights with Fina. Hey, Fina, Fina, waiting up now. You know, just they drop bombs every now and then. And hey, don't forget, Fina and, uh, Fina and Amaka, sure to say they never get together very well like that. Amaka, as we say, Fina is a witch, Fina is a dissonance, like that. And don't forget that the housemates they were meshed together after Kes and Farm Survey were evicted on Sunday. Yeah, Sunday was when they had a uh, eviction show. Drama, relationships, fights, and more are what viewers signed up for. On the Big Brother Nigeria reality show, and the housemates have been living up to it with their daily dose of content. <laughs> Don't forget that Khalid and Daniela, uh, they've been that yeah, they've been evicted too. Uh, Khalid was saying that he himself and uh, <laughs> he lived by it and nothing happened. That uh, it was just aggressive kissing. Well, I don't want to go into that, Jerry. It is just three days of big imagining the housemate. And things have gotten heated with house me. Don't forget that it was just at two houses. We had level one house and level two houses before uh, they've been merged together since Sunday. American lover boy, shit, that fine boy. He had a face off with Fina, his best friend's girlfriend, over their wager task. Wait till come up, let me just you. During their wager task deliberations, Fina, who was having a bad day and was in an angry state, had walked out of them. Hmm. Shex took things personally as he lashed out at her. Bragging, Shex said that if he and Fina were to be placed for possible eviction, she would be evicted. Well, trust Fina now. Trust, Fina will always give back to back. I don't be Fina. She questioned if his mother was the owner of Big Brother. <laughs> for him to be so assured of her eviction, like, ah, ah. Like, people, people, oh, <laughs> Fina, Fina, I don't know. Yeah. So she, is, he, is he your mother who owns Big Brother? For you to be, but many people took to the comment section to drum support for Fina. Someone wrote the Fina, we are standing. Someone wrote delusional, proud boy. Yeah, but be like, say people don't they see, say shakes, proud, small, small. Someone wrote, even the shakes, no Fina is the show. <laughs> Someone said, shakes don't finally meet his match. Well done, Fina, I'm proud of you. And that person wrote, Lord, shake doesn't know. If you're up against Fina, Baba, you are going on for sure. Someone wrote, Shex made his match. The final comment, someone wrote, now the show just started. How I wish beauty was still around. <laughs> Honestly speaking, that would have been very, very awesome. Yeah, recall that for the first time in the show that the male housemate clashed over their supposed love interest. Hmm. 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 Seriously. I'm telling you. Ex-head of house, Elo Swag, got into a heated argument with fellow housemate Chomzi and Chichi. The two constantly talked about Elo Swag and Fina's intimate kissing during the Saturday night party. Elo Swag, irritated with the constant talks, warned them to stop discussing the subject matter. And, you know, he said, just, just stop talking about this. Chomzi and Chichi, 
unbothered with his feelings lashed out at him. <laughs> Bella, in defense of her friends, waded into the issue and attacked Elo Swag. Where the issue escalated from there as Elo Swag took offense. <laughs> Where po- someone called Don't, don't Talk say, Be like, say, the, the two, the, 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 this boy, Big Brother and Niger housemate. Be like, say, Big Brother go, he leave the house for them. The way this son, this son's not like, the way they're the there. Well, Elo Swag warned them to stay away from the matter. Then Bella lashed out at him. She dared him to beat her in her world. She said, if I do it, come and beat me. She just jumped in and rather than try to calm the situation, he took to his babe's side. That was where I, I instead of him to just, I you know, being mature and a yeah, guy, yeah, you know, you be a guy now, just forget about that. Yeah, babe, stop that. Oh, yeah, now. You know, that, oh, I miss Lecon for season six, for season five lockdown. Lecon, you know, he matches me now. Lecon had his ways, oh, you know. You know, you know, Shanks is almost doing like, uh, what's this guy's name? Praise, praise. I mean, I first did remember praise for season five. Uh, I was also able to lock down and praise to the way it was, uh, <laughs> the way, you know, all this our family of a shit. Hmm. He jumped in and another tried to, instead of trying to come, he took to his website. He questioned why Elo Swag would respond to Bella's death. He said, how can a babe say, come and beat me? And you as a guy would respond to it. <laughs> He even threatened to beat up Elo Swag if he didn't mind how he talked to his babe. Ah ah, do not come near me. I'll beat you and go. <laughs> Giddy Fire went in and pitched tent with Elo Swag. Hey, he stated that Elo Swag should be allowed to express himself and shouldn't be shut up. No one should shut Elo Swag up. If he says he did not like it, that should not be a problem. Well, in the comment section, Nigerians expressed disappointment with Shakes. For letting his feelings for Bella to cloud him, seriously speaking, like people really, really are not like, ah, no, Shex, you are stupid. Ah. So you are now a lover, boy. Ah, you are a fool. <laughs> a lot of, and as they go, be like, say, hey, for this week, for this week, eviction. <laughs> Baba, if you go out, so well, let's just wait till it happens. Thank you very much. This is DG Chidoli Jiskalo. My name is Kenji, the king of self, and I love you. Thank you for watching, and I hope you loved the video you just watched. For more and more exciting videos, please do not turn away from this channel. Constantly visit this channel. Also, keep subscribing. Keep, keep subscribing. And also, keep telling someone about Oliver TV. Thank you.